Hi there, Chuck here in Salt Lake City. We had office hours. Uh, one student showed up with a great story, very interesting story. So here he is. So uh, what's your name? Brian Beecroft. Brian? So uh, uh, when did you take uh, my Coursera class? Uh, it was last year, I want to say early to mid of did, the year. Did you finish? I did. So tell me a little bit about your, uh, your education. Uh, well, I, after high school I wasted a few years and I actually opted not to do the college thing and uh, ended up lucking out with a really great job in the tech industry uh, doing support for SSL certificates and uh, certificate, uh, certificate authority type stuff and uh, from there just worked my way up into sysadmin type work, uh, network admin stuff, network engineer type stuff and now, uh, now I help manage uh, cloud infrastructure uh, for a company over in San Diego. So did you, did you take any classes at community colleges or anything or is it all self-taught? Uh, during my last year of high school, I took uh, some technical classes like at a remote, uh, you know, kind of midway community tech college. Uh, but it was web design stuff, and they didn't get too in-depth, and it didn't really hook me. And so... So you pretty much just picked it up and, and, and found a way. Yeah. And, and uh, you've been living on your own this whole time, mm -hmm. right? You, you found ways to support yourself and kind of a creature education. How, how, how then does a Coursera fit into the picture? Uh, well, it's kind of a free time. Uh, I'm married without any kids. I have a couple dogs, and so I have a lot of free time at home. And uh, I, I try to always learn as much as I can, uh, regardless of whether the subject uh, it benefits the career or not. But uh, Coursera has been really cool in that I, I can find courses uh, and get notified about them in advance and then uh, just tailor one week a night to, to studying stuff. And so what are some of the other Coursera courses you've taken? Uh, I did an intro to digital sound design course. Uh, I've also done a, one of the Berkeley courses on sound, uh, songwriting. So aside from computers and networking type stuff, I also try to uh, learn as much as I can about music and synthesis. What, so wh where's, where's the plan go? Where does it kind of go in the future for you? Uh, I don't look too far ahead. So for now, I'm just trying to keep up with internet trends and security and networking and cloud stuff is pretty big right now. That's where it's at. And uh, the Coursera thing is also pretty interesting. I think MOOCs are a really cool idea. Is there anything about um, anything about MOOCs that sort of worry you in any way? Or, does it bother you? Do you fear it? Do you think that like the world's going to come to an end or anything like that? No, I don't think anything is going to come to an end. Uh, if there's a concern, it's just uh, a widespread acknowledgement for like the accreditation. Uh, accreditation. Uh, just just some kind of respect for for it being valued knowledge as opposed to just people watching online videos, I guess. Yeah. So do, have you sort of used your certificate in any professional situation? Have you used it as evidence of skill? Have you used it in an interview? Uh, no, because uh, I've been pretty settled into my current job for a couple years, and so uh, it's just to help pad my own skills. Um, I mean, I'm sure I'll add it to a resume or a LinkedIn profile at some point, but for now it's just, it's just self-betterment. If, do you think it's going to change how education works? I do, and it seems like it kind of already is. Talk about that. Uh, the amount of people I've seen subscribing onto the MOOCs that I've participated in on Coursera, uh, the fact that it's a global thing uh, seems pretty, pretty interesting, and I hope that continues. Uh, I like that Coursera supports, they try to uh, provide heavy support for as many languages as they can. And the forums are really active in the regions uh, and languages that people need uh, for info. So, yeah, it's 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 impressive and, and very cool, very future. Any negatives or downsides? Um, like I mentioned, maybe just the the level of respect uh, that it can hopefully gain compared to other colleges or or universities. Okay, thanks a lot. Yeah, you bet.